Timo Schmidt and James Carter, who have a plan to deliver organic ingredients and recipes to the door. Hello, this is James and I'm Timo. Do you find it difficult to cook healthy and delicious meals during the week? Writing a shopping list, going to the store and carrying home heavy bags can be pretty time consuming. Every week we design 10 new recipes for you to choose from to cook according to your preferences. Everything is then delivered straight to your door in the exact portion sizes. So there's absolutely no food waste. Um, we'd now like to invite one of you uh, to prepare our smoked trout salad meal. Um, of course, if, if none of you would like to do it, me and Timo will prepare it while we take your questions. I absolutely don't want to do it. I haven't cooked in 28 years. <laughs> <laughs> I'll do it. Sure, great, fantastic. An accomplished pitch from the boys behind Gusto. As Duncan Bannatyne gets to grips with the ingredients, you hungry, Peter? Deborah Meaden wants to get a taste of their business model. Where are you sourcing products from? So we've got a fishmonger in Scotland. We've got a farmer in Devon supplying the meat. The veg comes from uh, Somerset, Kent, mainly from the UK. Not not entirely, but mainly. Um, it's all organic. All these ingredients become in separate bottles, marked. Absolutely. Yeah. So it's labelled, you know exactly what it is. So what happens when somebody tries to deliver and there's nobody there? Has that, has that happened to you yet? Our delivery success rate is 99% at the moment. That's an excellent margin. Is that it? Beautiful. Yep, absolutely. It looks wonderful. Mmm. Can we taste it, Peter? There you go. Go and sit down and eat it. Duncan, that's really good. Thank you. Well done, Mr. Bannatyne. <laughs> so far, so good. The food's going down well with the dragons, and the entrepreneurs are keeping their cool. Every time I've had one of those boxes delivered yep. with, with organic vegetables in, I've ended up wasting a lot. I don't know why. Mm -hmm. uh, one of the key points I'd make to that, if I can jump in, is that um, quite often with those vegetable boxes, um, the thing that's missing is that extra step where it's made really easy for you to turn that into a fantastic recipe, which um, you, I don't think you'll ever be in that situation where the box arrives and you don't know what to no, make. No, and I think it's, it's great that you're showing somebody how to cook it. Mm, guys, you've done really well. You're both great. Anything to do with organic, delivering, you know, the packaging is great. I really like this. Now, Peter Jones wants to find out if the deal struck with their angel investors leaves any room for manoeuvre. What happens if I get a really good negotiating position in the den here and then when we walk out, the investors turn around and say, that Peter Jones, you've given away all of that. I want the same deal. Um, could we ask... Um... Uh, if uh, if you would like to make an offer, what um, what what level would be uh, satisfactory to you? Or would... Well, I'd like to just get it up. Uh, you went to the back of the room to think about the dilemma that I gave you, which mm -hmm. was that if I was to get an offer today that was a lot richer in terms of equity than the investment that you've been offered through this angel network, would the angel network walk away? We probably can't agree to a deal that is a lot richer. Guys, I think that what you've created is, is potentially great and I think that you've been very open about your angel investment network and I think it would shut the door to future funding. So I'm going to say reluctantly, I'm out. Mm -hmm. Thank okay, you. thanks. A perturbed Peter Jones walks away from the deal. It leaves Duncan Bannatyne as the last dragon standing. I really love this. I think it's absolutely fantastic. I'm going to become a customer. That's good. <laughs> I'm going to buy your products. Brilliant. 
And when I go in the summer with my lad to my cabin at Lake Windermere, I'm going to have your boxes delivered and we're going to sit and cook together. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and it's going to be fantastic. I love it. It's fantastic.